All right, guys, welcome back. Today we're gonna learn on this 2018 Freightliner Cascadia how to replace the cabin air filter. I'm gonna show you where it's located at, and the best part is you don't need tools, just your fingers. So what I wanna do right now, I'm gonna show you how to do that, and again, no tools. All right guys, so right here is part of the air box cleaner. On the back side of this right here, you're gonna see where it's a long strip and you just push down with the tab. When you push down with your fingers, like I said, no tools. You're gonna pull, push down, the cover comes off and you just pull the filter out, which I got it out earlier. Now she's in fight me. All right, ooh, this one's dirty, so I definitely gotta replace this one. All right, and then also on the filter, it'll show you an arrow, and that's for airflow. So make sure when you take it out, it goes there, and then also when you pull this down, you'll also see where it says open, and then there's an arrow pointing towards airflow, which it would be going when you're looking at it to the left. If you're not looking at it, to the right. All right, so, and it's like I said, very easy, no tools. You would just slide the new one back in. I'm just putting this one back in, but I will be replacing it. Put it back in. And again, you start from the top and you push up. No tools. So that shouldn't take you that long and anybody can do it, which I'm pretty sure I can get my kids to do it as well. But it'll be fun and it saves you guys money and the best part is, like I said, this was my favorite part where no tools. And you guys will probably remember that the older trucks, it was up here, it's no longer there. It, the new spot is located right here, which is the best part and I love it. All right, so the good news about this way these trucks are coming along, you know, this 2018 from when I started, when I was doing the, the trucks myself, I remember that I would have to remove the dash and a few panels to grab the filter. And then there used to be the one where it was underneath the seat, especially on some internationals. Now on the Freightliner Cascadias, where we see them that they're up here, you know, two screws and a tray. And now as, you know, things keep progressing, the trucks are getting better. You don't even need the tools. It's right here out in the open and you're not even wasting any time get in and out. And you don't really need a technician anymore. Just a little know-how of where the stuff is on your truck and you can do it yourself to save some money. So the best part is, you know, things keep constantly changing for the best. Hopefully more people get to know more about their trucks and save you guys money, which is always good for everybody, including myself, because I like to save money on my vehicles myself. All right, guys, I hope that you liked the video today. Uh, hopefully it was a very informal. Now you guys know where the cabin filter is located at, and the best part is no tools. Um, if you like what you saw today, don't forget to hit the like button. If you have any questions or concerns, please leave me a comment at the bottom. And guys, the biggest one is for more stuff coming your way, don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you guys very soon. Ciao.